G'day guys, Sir Prawnalot here with another video. Today I have some really crappy news about my uh, shrimp tank. Uh, I've got planaria. Um, if you don't know what planaria are, they're little flat worms um, that kind of kill your shrimp <laughs> and uh, cause a few issues in your tank. Um, I saw some small white worms about two days ago in my tank. And I didn't think much of them. They didn't look like planaria. They were really small. I just thought they were the normal worms you get sometimes that are okay. Um, come today and I see a big fat planaria just scooting along. And then I have a closer look and there's like maybe 20 of them just sitting there in the um, lava rock. Um, I know it's my fault that I've got them. Um, they come or they, you know, grow a lot. Um, from, you know, extra feet, like overfeeding, and then there's more food in the tank. So, obviously it's my fault. I can see that there's scraps, and you can see in the video that there's uh, scrap bits of food that are rotting away in the lava rock. Um, so I know that I've been overfeeding, and I'm just going to cut back on the overfeeding. But they're still going to be there, so to get rid of them, I'm going to get some no planaria and dose that into my tank and, yeah, just nuke them completely. Um, the problem with them is if you try and squish them or, you know, take them all out, it's just really hard. Um, if you squish them, they regenerate their body and they come back as, like, two or how many pieces they've been broken up to. Um, so, yeah, if you chop it up to five bits, that makes five planaria. And if you try and take them out, it's almost impossible because they hide in the gravel and they just hide on things. Um, you can get them pretty much from adding anything into your tank, um, whether it be a plant, a fish even, they um, can go in the fish, I think, and they sit on the fish, uh, shrimp, things like that. I'm really not sure where these ones came from. Um, I'm a bit baffled because I haven't done anything new in the tank for a while. Um, so it's a bit yeah worrying. Um, there's none in my blue dream tank that I know of yet, but I think I may just uh, dose that in case just because they can, you know, if they're in one, they might be in the other, and I don't really want to lose any blue shrimp. Uh, the reason they kill your shrimp is because they leave, like, a slime trail, and the slime trail is really toxic. Um, a lot like snails, how they have the trail, it's kind of like that. And what happens is the shrimp will walk over it and, like, eat it, I guess, um, and it will just, like, paralyse them pretty much, and then they get eaten alive by the planaria. Um, there's a few different types of planaria, I think it's like white and black or brown or something, but either way, they're all pretty bad. Um, if there's one in your tank, it's not the worst, but if there's a lot, that'll definitely kill off your shrimp. Um, you can tell if it's a planaria because they're like a long, slender, white, uh, worm, and on the top is like a triangle sort of head. But, um, yeah, I really hate them, I hate worms in general, there's something about them that just creeps me out. So I will be, uh, yeah, nuking them, as I say. Um, so I thought I'd just put this video up so you understand if you see any white worms in my video what they are and, yeah, then I'm getting rid of them. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all. I'll have another video out shortly. Um, just wanted to make people aware of these. Um, it's always important to check your tank and check what you're adding in, I guess. Um, if shrimp are dying, it's, you know, always good to look around and see maybe it's the worms that are there, maybe it's something else, but, yeah. The only problem with, um, the no planaria is it kills them off and it will also kill snails. I don't have any snails, but if you are, do, it gets a bit problematic. Um, but yeah, it'll kill them all off and then obviously your ammonia will spike and stuff like that because there's dead creatures in there. So you have to do heaps of water change and make, make sure you don't miss any uh, bodies or anything. Um, but I will be redoing that tank sh soon anyway. Um, I've got a bunch of gravel and rocks and stuff ready to go. I just need to buy the new tank. Um, so hopefully I'll just be able to nuke it and then remove everything and move everything into other tanks while I organise the new tank. Um, I think I'm going to put the tetras in with the better fish. Uh, just for like a week or so, and put the shrimp into their own tank. Um, I'll set up another tank and do a video about that. So thank you for watching. I uh, hope you understand what planaria are. Um, I'll, there's more research on them if you want to go look at more research for them. Uh, definitely worth reading into how to prevent them. 
Um, pretty much just don't overfeed, but yeah. So thanks for watching. Uh, comment, subscribe, and like. Um, if you have any more questions to ask, I might know the answer. If not, yeah, go search them up. Cheers.